Marge, a 71-year-old caregiver, fights for the relationship of her life, sustaining her Walter with energy, hope, and love. up more, you know, at first I said I was 71, but I don't feel 71. I'm very fortunate that I can, you know, see, I got the wrinkles, I look old, but what the heck, at my age, you can't worry about that just so you, you know, I'm going to enjoy every day. I get up in the morning and I tell Walter, thank God we have another day, another day, and we, we, we don't plan that much for the future. We did. We were going we're gonna to have a 50th anniversary next year. We were making all kind of plans, but little by little we're there diminishing. We're making them smaller and smaller and smaller, but we are going to have a nice celebration, hopefully. If, if, if you had to do things over again, yes. uh, can you think of a time that you think would have been good for you and for Walter to talk about advanced directives, about living wills, and about funeral arrangements? Is there a time that would have been better than I don't Another? think Walter would even want to discuss it. He was at that point, I'm not going to die, you know, mm -hmm. until toward the end. Until towards the end. Now, me, like I saw what happened, and I made sure that I'm not going to go through, because I've seen a lot of even sicker people than Walter at the hospital there. Mm -hmm. And I made sure that my children are not going to go through this, really. Mm -hmm. His attitude is better. He's even smiling more. He sings a little bit. He watches more, tell, more of his tapes and things. He's, he's just taking an interest in things more. Okay, let's go. Now Walter is doing more for himself, but if this continues like this, I'm going to have a broken back, I'll tell you. 